Verse 28. Then they will call on me, but I will not answer. They will seek me diligently, but they will not find me. Because they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord. They would have known of my cancer and despised my every rebuke. Therefore they shall eat the fruit of their own way and be filled to the full with their own fancies. Verse 32. For the turning away well of the simple will slay them. And the complacency of fools will destroy them. But whoever listens to me will dwell safely. And will be secure without fear of evil. Reden, why will you wait for the heaven and earth to mock you? Because you choose not to seek him at the appointed time. You started to look for him at a time when he may not be found. Seek him now, ye sinners, ye criminals. Criminals in government. Criminals in the church. Criminals in the society. Seek the Lord now when he may be found. Let us see. I'm advising you. Be warned. Don't say I didn't warn you. Be warned of the consequences of the choice you are making now for this year 2011. As we enter into January 1, 2011, seek the Lord and confess your sins and follow after righteousness. Politicians, seek the maker of the people which you are about to rule. If you fail, you will regret. And later on, you will still call him for help, but he will not hear you. Isaiah 1, 15. Isaiah chapter 1, verse 15. Yes. When you spread out your hands, I will hide my eyes from you. Oh my God. Even though you make many prayers, I will not hear. Your hands are full of blood. Wicked people, politicians that are not clean. The Bible is saying, even though you wear 30 years of Agbada and come to the church and donate and carry your hand, build a house, build a church, buy bus, buy cars, donate cows, donate rice, when you know you are not clean, you are not a child of God, you got that money from corruption, then you come to the church. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. All things are possible. Hallelujah, we God. All things are possible. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. Amen. And the blind pastor will say, God bless you. God is saying, spread your hand. Make offering. He will hide his face. He will not hear you. Why not seek for him at a time when he will listen to you and hear you? We have entered the new year. You need a new heart. You that is in the church. The woman who took the church land and sold it. Was she not sitting down like you? Seek the Lord now. Even that same woman that took the church land. Seek the Lord now when he may be found. He can still forgive you. And the talk, the higher killer that are around you. Seek the Lord now. Let, let me tell you. If we just see you on Sunday service, you just run to this place and kneel down. Baba, what I've done is bad. Baba, do what you like to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We are not talking about land. We are talking about your soul. Maybe that time, will be the time I will say, get out, go and take the land, but bring your soul. We talk about heaven, not this earth. We are made to be fools for heaven's sake, but before heaven, we are wise. We are wise. We are wise. We do many things that look foolish, but in the sight of God, we are wise. You thought you are wise, but you are a fool. Brethren, 
Why not make a change now before it is too late? Why not make a change? Micah chapter 3 verse 4. Yes? Micah chapter 3 verse 4. Yes? Then they will cry to the Lord. They will now cry. These wicked people I'm robber, kidnapper, like that uh, man, that first us we are talking about in EBS. Crime what? He was crying to God, have mercy on me. He was calling on the police, have mercy on me. Hear now. He lives to now. Yes? But he will not hear them. Oh my God. He will even hide his face from them at that time. Because they have been evil in their deeds. Do you need any more interpretation? What are you waiting for? You are hiding to commit fornication with that small girl. Only, only one day. Only one day I was caught. Very simple. Very, very simple. Very, very simple. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know whether my wife will be bold for the sake of soul salvation. Come again. We have spent many years in the ministry. But maybe you are hearing it for the first time. Maybe you will remember what happened one night. What is it? I'm telling you, that thing you are doing everywhere, that is where your shame lies. When you left my house, you thought you were wise. You gave me two big, big guests as housemaid to be cooking for me. Were you aware that one night you caught me when I was trying to move, even while you were around to sleep with one of them? Can you still recollect it? I cannot remember. Brought two girls. You are hearing the confession now. Take heart, for it is too late to judge me. God has forgiven me. And you women, are you learning a lesson? Big girls with big, big breasts. It may be your, your own sister. You are a criminal if you allow your sister with big, big bottom, big, big breast to be cooking for your husband. Then you go work. You see, you trust your husband. You are a fool. Don't trust a man when it comes to that sexual sin. A man is an animal. He has no conscience when it comes to sex. I lost my integrity, lost my conscience. She has forgotten. But the sinner never forgets where he went wrong. I was going to meet that girl. She was lying on the ground near my wife. And she just said, hey, where are you going? I, I, know, I was coming to look at the children. I was coming to look at the children. That's why she didn't understand. My people, seek him now. Seek him now, viewers. You are in various churches. And your churches are 10,000, 50,000. With 450 uh, fornication a day. May God save us. Psalm 18, verse 41. Then we close. Psalm 18, verse 41. Yes. They cried out, but there was none to save, even to the Lord, but he did not answer them. I pray that you will not refuse to turn to the Lord now and repent of all your evils. May God answer you as you seek him now. In this January 2011, nation, Africa, the world over, I pray that you will know God who was the nation. He said, blessed is every nation that trusted in God. May Nigeria be blessed. May Edo State be blessed. May CAC Deliverance Center be blessed in Jesus' name. Happy New Year. Come and have experience like no other at Christ Apostolic Church Deliverance Center. Experience heaven on earth. Many has testified. Sinners becoming saints. All in the name of Jesus by the power of his word. Time has come for you to repent and surrender your life to Jesus Christ. Be part of our deliverance service every Sunday, 8 a.m. to 12 noon. Thursdays, Believers College and Youth Fellowship, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Wednesdays, a Bible study, 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Fridays, night vigils, 10 p.m. till dawn. 
Log on to our website www.cacdeliveringcenter.org.